Uh, we have Kara Parker right now from the McNabb Center in Sevier County with yeah. us here. First of all, thanks so much for coming in Thank today. Thank you for having me. We were just talking. You, you've already had a lot of people kind of reaching out, uh, those that experienced, especially experienced 2016, we now have. reaching out again. Mm -hmm. We have, and I know other agencies in Sevier County mm -hmm. have as well. Yeah. So, so. What do you tell these people? I mean, how, how, do you, how do you, for anyone really that's coping with whether it's a wildfire or any traumatic event like mm -hmm. this, what do you tell them what, to help them kind of cope? Well, for those people that are currently evacuated, mm -hmm. that are experiencing this disaster right now, the main thing to know would just be that there are certain things that are really common to experience. Sure. So those would be fear, distress, and anger. Um, really, for people of all ages, those are really common, very normal to experience, um, especially you're out of your daily routine. Right. You may not know if your home is um, still intact, and you may be staying somewhere that you're not comfortable with with. Um, so just being aware that that happens and it's really just being, um, you know, attentive to how long that persists after this um, disaster ends and kind of dealing with the aftermath. Sure, sure. Are, are there other resources out there that people should be looking into to kind of help them out as well? There are. So the McNabb Center is definitely a resource sure. for people who are experiencing um, any type of emotions that they would like some support with. Um, also keeping in mind we can help out the kiddos who may right. be struggling um, during this time. And the McNabb Center in Sevier County, um, the phone number is 865 429-0557. Um, you can also reach us at McNabCenter.org. And then another great place for resources is the MountainTough.org right. site. So McNabb Center was, um, we were very appreciative to be able to work with the Mountain Tough organization in the 2016 wildfires and we're continuing to um, be listed as a resource there along with some other great agencies. Okay. okay, definitely, yeah. And I know that Mountain Tough was just brought back just recently. It was, so, yeah. Um, coping mechanisms. Mm -hmm. I know you mentioned already there's adults, but also the kids. We mm -hmm. can't forget them as well. Right. All of this. Mm -hmm. So one thing that's challenging is how to maintain a routine. Yeah, uh, sure. You know, if you're not in your home, maybe staying with family or friends, and um, just realizing that as much of a that normal routine that you can establish is beneficial to adults and kids. Um, any positive kind of relationships that you can continue to maintain mm -hmm. so reaching out to friends and family you know if you go to church regular maybe reaching out to those folks um, just anything any positive activities that your family can do during this time are helpful um, then just being sure you know try your best to get enough sleep um, kind of keep the same diet that you typically do exercising can be helpful as well as listening to music so that's just a handful sure, sure. Um, but you know, if folks have questions about that, they can reach out to us. I was going to say, and again, just real quick, how do we reach out to you? Mm -hmm. So McNabb Center in Sevier County can be reached at 865-429-0557 okay. or mcnabcenter.org. Awesome. Yeah. Kara, appreciate everything you guys do. I appreciate do. you. Thanks Thank a lot you. for making the trip over. 